Mm. Flush Creek before. As soon as I start recording. It's been a while. No matter how much time passes or whatever's been going on, I miss you guys. And I know there hasn't been much content for October, but I'm really hoping that very soon I get to record some special videos for you guys that I've been thinking of and uh, wanted to bring to life. Most of them are random, but it is random upload birthday month. Other than that, I've seen it chapter two in theaters three times. Um, I, I just love reunion movies where everyone reunites and all the dialogue is just remember when and reminiscing of like the last time that they were all together. There's scares that show what everyone's been hiding from everyone else. And then the other scares brings their fears back when they return to Derry. So it's just like a jump scare fest, which I really don't mind. It's too bad some people can't have a good time with that, but I just love seeing like the unique ways of showing Pennywise on screen relating to our beloved characters. The Hall of Mirrors is my favorite. I made a tweet of how excited I look when I get to see my girlfriend shit her pants to my favorite jump scare scene. So because of jump scares and because I'm nostalgic all the time is the reason why I enjoy it so much. If you see me at the movies going to see it, just just leave me be, I'm going through a lot. And after seeing the new Joker, I have now have a sudden urge to just laugh in public. I, his performance is really good, I don't, I don't want to ruin that. Cosmonauts video, I actually agree with that the soundtrack builds with the Joker as the movie goes on and how like more messed up stuff happens to him. I watched it a second time after seeing like theory videos and after watching them and seeing it again, I was like, oh, I get it. So that was an experience and a half. I really enjoyed that, but it's better because of jump scares. Get into it. <laughs> I've been really into pins lately. I have myself a little collection on the table. This one took forever to get here, but I'm grateful that I have now. It's a Game Grump seven year anniversary pin. Good. Where's the damn one? Oh, I have this little Dan one. Rin got me Aaron and Dan. You get to see Dan from far away, but Aaron up close. And then Rin also got me this one. Ah! Don't be a prick, because I love hedgehogs. They're adorable. Especially baby ones, but like, they don't really get that big anyway. I mean, remember when you saw a hedgehog that was this big? No, because it's scary. But I have a little grab bag of pins uh, ordered for my birthday. Well, it's, it's not really in a bag and I'm grabbing all of them because I order them for myself, so it's not really a grab bag, it's just a grab. But it's uh, it's Thanksgiving weekend. Don't you love my non-existing transitions? <laughs> we got coconut cream pie, apple tarts, pumpkin pie. I have social anxiety, not a pie flavor. Even with like family, I, I can be quiet, but I still love like the time of the year where we just get to listen to a bunch of stories and if I'm ever mentioned I get to share what's going on with me so we're having a Ryan's birthday slash welcome back Sid and Dev birthday party on the 26th um, that I'm pretty excited about it's gonna be a good time I haven't really seen anyone of them I haven't seen anyone ever I'm lonely and to end the year on a good note I have dates booked to if, uh, for driving down to Pennsylvania in December. I'm so excited, but I'm gonna try to make time to visit them every single year, or w once a year, because I love them. Meeting them last year was just so exciting, and I wanna try and continue that for as long as I can, so the end. That's me for the rest of the year. I've made a notepad document writing down all the things, all the good things that have happened this year, so I can like remember them and like look over them in 2020. Isn't that like crazy? Like we're gonna be living in the next 20s. My life's gonna be in 2020 mode up in this biosh. I was actually at the cafe uh, talking about how I'd like to live to May 20th, 2069, because then it'd be 24, 2069. I don't wanna, I don't wanna die that day. I don't wanna die that day. Living to 2100 would be a miracle, but I, I'd really have to take care of myself. But thank you for listening. I hope you en enjoy. Hope you enjoyed me having a stroke. If you enjoyed, share with a friend. And I hope to see you in the next one. So, bye for now. See you soon.